Well, Whelan coming off one screen, finding Clifton Moore Jr. It's a team that likes to go down for the perimeter shots. Plains are almost traveling with it. Moore under the basket, getting an early dunk. He's having his struggles early on. Gladiators with this home crowd, trying to push the tempo. You know, you've played in this arena, and it's quite a nice place to play in, apparently. A beautiful place for an arena. It's always fun for me to play against guys and see them get better. He's much better off the dribble, getting in the lane, finding guys off the ball screen. It's a turnover there, but that's something he just keeps getting better and better. Tough finish there by Macy O.J. He actually stole it, or learned it, I should say, from his teammate Ignaz. Help me out with the last name. Brett Zakis. Brett Zakis, who is currently in Olympiacos of the Euro League. They played together at Orangeville Prep. And that's a good possession for Cheshire. But if you're Skyler White, you get your guy off the ground. Take the dribble, get in the paint, make the extra pass. As you see right there, easy dunk for Cam Holden. That's what Cheshire has to do. They're too fast for Caledonia. These two teams have been scrapping, trying to get as many good looks from the field as possible. Here's the post up. Clifton Moore Jr. elevating, going up, getting the ab one. Well, I guess when he goes that high. But I don't really count that. So Rome, Italy. I Virtus. chose, yeah, Virtus, uh, Virtus Roma, which is now, I don't even think, uh, in the first division anymore, but was coming off of a EuroLeague season when I signed there. Well, Maceo Jack going for a wide open three-pointer, can't get it. Chris, an offensive board. You said it, JT, number two in the British Basketball League in offensive rebounding and a dagger of an offensive second point at the end of the first quarter. Long live Holden. Maceo Jack all on the floor as well as Aaron Wright. Goes in, smooth little footwork again, Kat Christen. My oh, got it by Fraser Malcolm. He said pulls up on the baseline, smooth little play up the penetration. Well, Bothell trying to isolate, can't get anything. Phoenix with a 7-0 run. Another deep three, three is up, and it's good. Well, when they couldn't buy a bucket from three-point line, all of a sudden, quickly evolved into Trable Town. As back-to-back three-pointers coming from the Phoenix, the first two three-pointers. Two top score, two top five scorers in Maceo Jack and Aaron Ray have two points in Aaron Ray and six in Maceo Jack, your leading scorer at nine. as another three from Kyle Johnson when it raids the poor. Might be symbolic of how it's gone for the free throw line tonight for the Phoenix. I don't like to talk about stuff like that because if it ever happens to me, I'm going to be tight. Tough shot there by Pelizzi. Well, Pelizzi going in and just giving them a little bit of a heat check. Chago going baseline, can't get it. Caledonia leading by one. Finds Whelan, goes up. Whelan gets the ab one. Well, the GB International getting ready, not only for the British Basketball League trophy. By <laughs> Lucas Paliza. Looking a little bit like Milos Teodosic right there. Threading the needle of straight line chest pass down the floor. Well, they got to go quick. Right, trying to go down the middle. Pulls up for a three. Three is up, and it's good. Well, Aaron Wright cutting it down to a two-point ball game. You know, for him, he's been struggling a little bit from the three-point line. I'd like to see him get a, a better shot just to get his rhythm before you get into those tougher shots. Well, finds Clifton Moore. Junior goes in with a two-handed jab. I think that sometimes he gets himself out of position. He confuses his own teammates going for the ball right there. Paliza wide open. It's Skyler White now. That's exactly what we're talking about. You let him hit one, and now when he's got it going, he can fill it up in a hurry. A couple quick threes for him. Well, this game just coming into life a little bit better. Both teams struggled from the three-point line in the first half. All of a sudden, finding a bit more confidence. Lutz made his last one, goes for another one. Again, everything seems to be raining in for both these two teams. Points so far here in the third quarter. He adds another element to this Cheshire offense. When him picking and pop. Well, Cheshire's free throw shooting tonight. Look at that. 11 missed free throws. And it's old saying you don't want to look back on the game and think it could have been a different outcome as they can see a smooth play. The one dribble come across half court shots over a contest. But as you see Patrick Whelan again, he is so tough getting downhill. The progression from him, Quincy Rideau, as good as he is, sometimes he does force the issue at times. Very good point guard. Just get good shots just like that every time. Get the ball where it's supposed to be. And you're a really good offense. You're a really good team. Just over two minutes left. Quincy Rideau now going in and around, bullying his way to the bucket and just taking. Trying to cut this down to a two, potentially one possession ball game. Finds Holden. Holden nowhere to go. Finds White. He's made two threes. Make it three here in the third quarter. And that could have been an interception. Now it is. Cam Christen now trying to go with your step. Goes in, finishes to perfection. And now it is a one-point deficit. Three-point deficit. Phoenix now with the ball in their hands. White pump fakes. 
Going for three, number four. It's up. Oh, baby! This guy, well, JT, he is shooting the lights out. Tough shot there. I would have liked to see Clifton Moore go up over Rye. He's had, or over Skyler White. He's had success with that all night long. And there you go again, Aaron Rye. Cheshire catches a break. Almost with a good defense. And again, that is a cruel play for Caledonia because it's going to be an ad one. And it's just finding productivity on offense. Finding productivity on offense. And there you had the mismatch. Another turnover by Rideau. And there's the productivity right there. But on the last possession, if you're Clifton Moore, go score. Prince almost maybe just needs to. Quincy Rideau goes in, sends almost down to the baseline. What a play. Three points is three points. Doesn't matter how you get to it. One possession game again. Almost overpassed. Paliza with a heck of a steal. Well, Whelan can tie the game up. It's a oh baby. Are you kidding me? But then the defense. Confusion. Oh, it's only two three points, but that may have just saved their opening game in the British Basel League trophy. Bothwell now sizing up, turns it over. Oh, Phoenix can go for it. It's up. Well, oh, we are going into overtime. No buzzer beater tonight. One point lead to the Phoenix. To more now, fancy this mismatch goes for the tough fadeaway, but again, no problem. You said it. You go back to that three at the end of the third quarter when he forced a shot, and he hasn't really hit one since then. Good defense there by White containing Patrick Whelan. Here's Cam Christen in the open floor where he's tough and won. He's been a monster all night long. Again, I would like to see them just throw it on the block and let Clifton Moore play one-on-one -on -one as Rideau just puts <laughs> Frazier Malcolm under the rim. That's the bully play we talked about. That's the bully play. It gives the, gives the rock a baby celebration after that. It's a tough matchup for Frazier Malcolm. And if you're Cheshire, that's what you want to do. That's the weakest defender on the floor for Caledonia. Attack him and another steal. Here's Aaron Rye. Getting rejected while Bothwell just said, not in my house. Well, here's that rejection. No in me, Casa. Skyler White went for the block. Someone has to help Skyler White when he goes to, to contest the shot. Someone has to check out his man, Rideau, getting in his bag now. Woo! Well, Rideau is just working magic on the floor at the moment. 16 points. Now they find Fraser Malcolm, they get it back. Well, they gotta go quick. Get the more Junior going baseline. Now it's down to a two-point ball game. 25.9 as now Ben Thomas. He makes his free throw to Logan. He misses this free throw. Yep, well, they gotta go quick miss. now. 2.8. Clifton Moore puts up a prayer, and there you have it. Cheshire Phoenix escape. Last season's finals. The second place runners up win the game.